So after the summer's done and all the shows are done, we're back to doing some vlogs and bringing petrol hedonism life to your screens and YouTube. So please ensure you're subscribing, you'll get the notifications, you're liking, give us a comment, tell us what you want to see more of. But just realised we've never done anything on the shop truck. Shop truck, which has been influenced and kind of inspired by the original Gas Monkey shop truck, which we had on display at petrol hedonism live. This is our Petrodinism shop truck, and this has been an absolute legend all year, taking the flags, all the gear to the shows, and hasn't missed a beat. It's needed new brakes at one point, because literally the discs were shot, and EBC brakes stepped in with that one. But the shop truck, on it since 2007, Petrol Hedonism at the Sharnbrook, has been a legend. But today we're here for the marriage. Now, if you've been on factory tours, Ferrari, Lamborghini, uh, Jaguar, anything, Usually, most of them call that moment when the engine and the car come together, they call it the marriage. And we're here today because for about four months now, we've been rebuilding, finding the parts, forging, polishing, and boring out the engine of the petrol hedonism Cayman GT4 wannabe. That's no wannabe anymore. It's gonna be something really special. Let's go have a look inside. Well, the GT4 was a wannabe, ain't no more. And we've got the new rebuilt engine here, Petrol Hedonism Performance and Motorsport. Luke's gonna talk us through what he's done to this engine and as he raises the car, it's time for the marriage. This is Luke. Luke has single-handedly built this engine. We've had it bored out to 3.9, forged and polished everything. Uh, there was a lot of comments on the car when we first built it about what we should do to it. And I think we've gone other side of the scale. We'll talk to Luke in a minute because he's a bit busy ratcheting right now, right? <laughs> nice shiny sport cats for the car. So it's another upgrade. It's going to have a new sound too. Sick. So Luke has single-handedly rebuilt this engine. Mate, what have you done to it? So it's a stroked 3.4, taking it to a 3.8. High compression piston, forged rod, ported and polished in the reds. So that's why it's cost the amount it's cost, because we've done a lot to the inner workings of this engine. Yep. Sports cats. Sports cats, so tubular manifolds. The so sound's going to be better than it was as yep. well. Obviously we had the nice sports exhaust that was cat back before. Sports cats now, uh, polished heads, forged, polished everything. Yep. Oversized pistons, you said. Yep. So what's it going to perform like? GT4? Better, or hopefully. Better? Hopefully better. That's why we're calling it a GT4 CS. Is that Carrera Sport? No, it's a club sport. <laughs> Chiro special. Chiro special. <laughs> so we've just witnessed the marriage of the newly built engine with the Cayman GT4 CS. The car's being reborn. It's going to take Luke a couple of days to just bring everything together, plumb it all in again and get it fired up. Will we be back for the firing up? I'm not sure but we'll definitely be here to pick it up and take it down to its next stop, which is going to be Regal Autosports for the mapping and dyno uh, to ensure that she's tickety-boo, as they say, here at Petrol Hedonism Performance. So we're back here at Regal Autosport in Southampton. Oh, check out the GT3 over my shoulder right there and the Hurricane Supercharged earlier this year on our channel. But we're back here because we're in the final stages of getting her ready, the GT4 CS. Chris here and the team are veritable Porsche specialists. So there's nowhere else to bring us, get her tuned and mapped and ready for the road and the track than Regal Auto Sports. So we're gonna get off the trailer now. We're gonna get the first startup scoot. You ready for this? I'm ready. Let's go. So taking over the camera, here it is. How loud is it? I haven't seen this since the camera in April, I believe. It is so much louder. I can't wait for this.
GT4 CS is alive and well and breathing like an absolute dragon. We've called it the CS, it's not Challenge Stradale, it's not Carrera Sport, it is the Chiro Special GT3 race spec engine rebuilt by Petrol Hedonism Performance and Motorsport, Be Cool Air Conditioning Services. The team, Luke, Dave, Brett and everybody have smashed it out of the park to get this back on the road and we've had it dynoed. We've seen the dyno footage, 400, just under, 390 brake horsepower, but 500 newton meters of torque. That is more power than a factory spec GT4 from Porsche. So, we're doing something right. There's more power in it. We're gonna get it bedded in. We're gonna have some fun for it with it. We're gonna get it proper dirty as we are. Keep watching the channel, guys. Subscribe, like, hit that notifications button so you know when we publish another video. Stay on it, because Scoot's been out there as well, doing, doing some amazing things. And uh, over the winter, we're going to keep you entertained. Thank you.